Good morning, Hamilton. I'm so excited to see you here today on Thursday, October 31st. It is going to be a wonderful day of working hard and being kind. Let's go ahead and get started. We have Amar's birthday today in Ms. Heilman's room. Happy birthday, Amar. We hope you have a great birthday today. Um, just a reminder for our Feed Your Brain Word, you are learning about editing a movie um, this this week. So if you can write that in a sentence, put put something you've learned about it, how you've built your background knowledge, put it in the front office. I could be picking you tomorrow. All right. Also a reminder, tomorrow are our fall parties, which is great. And tomorrow is uh, Fall Colors Day. So make sure you wear a uh, fall color. So that could be orange or red or yellow or brown. Um, lots of lots of uh, beautiful fall colors. If you have a shirt with leaves on it, go for it, right? Um, okay, so, uh, and we'll have a great time at our fall parties. It's really important that you're making sure you're demonstrating self-control today and tomorrow morning so that you can enjoy the fall parties. Also, my uh, kindergarten, first and second grade friends, your schedule tomorrow will be different because of our fall parties. And that's okay. It's okay to have a different type of a schedule. We can be flexible about that. But I just wanted to remind you and give you that heads up. Last day to talk about self-control. I'm coming around to pass out awards today and tomorrow, which is really exciting. But self-control is choosing to do what's best even when you don't want to. And to have self-control means we can recognize what we can control and what we can't control. There are many things that we don't have control over. So those are the things that we can't worry about. You probably can't control the rules that your parents have or the rules that your teacher or principal has. Those are things you shouldn't worry about. You just need to follow them because you're not in control of them. Um, but you can control your reaction to them, right? You're in charge of how you react to a rule. Let's say you don't want to be completing an assignment in class. You're not in control of if you get to do that or not. That's not your choice. Your teachers are in charge. But you can control how you react to it. You can say, I'm going to make the right choice, do my work, and I'll probably get rewarded for it. Versus I'm not going to do it, I'm not going to learn, and I could have a consequence. Having self-control might look like obeying your parents or your school rules, um, and making sure you're remembering, I need to make sure I'm doing what's best, even if I don't want to. All right, so focusing on the things you do have control over. Your reaction is something you always have control over. All right, friends, I hope you have a wonderful day of working hard and being kind. Make today as great as you are. At this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. <laughs> 